We are back live at the WDSE WRPT Media Lounge, the beautiful media lounge here at the Catalyst Content Festival in Duluth. Right now, Julia Tokars and Bettina Bilger, mm -hmm. both with us, and the project is called Top Dog. It sure is. Who wants to take that on, a little <laughs> yeah. snapshot as to what this is. Yeah, absolutely. So um, this is kind of like my baby. I'm, I'm the writer, director, um, producer, actor in it. Uh, you know, it was kind of my vehicle towards it. Uh, it. It's about a plus size actress that's like struggling to come to terms with her place in the business. Uh, she feels like it's really shallow. She's having a hard time and she really just wants to rescue dogs. And through a um, kind of series of kismet events ends up working at an agency in Hollywood. She throws all her life away in New York to move to take this chance that she, after she meets this guy to um, work at this dog agency in Hollywood, which like represents famous Instagram dogs. On <laughs> that is quite, that, that's quite a synopsis. It's a lot. Yeah. It's a lot. But you know, what was your role in the film? Uh, I play a wonderful, obnoxious wife. Uh, I have a husband. We walk into a bar. We are kind of the epitome of obnoxious wealth, <laughs> if you will. Um, and this uh, is just bartending, and we just it's a really comedic, fun scene. So yeah. we kind of go nuts and, Over and just. The top. Yeah, just judge her, and, and it's, it's, yeah, it was it was super fun to shoot. We shot uh, in the middle of the night until five a.m., so it was it was a great great time. Um, her project has such heart and soul to it, which is something that I'm so I'm so proud to be a part of because she's just done such a fantastic job with it. So. We have a clip okay. that we're going to show our audience, <laughs> so we're going to throw that to the director. Roll that audio awesome. and video. I don't know. I think I'm going to quit acting. What? Hi. This is Katie McKenna. Hey, Katie. Hi. I don't know, dude. Oh I'm, like, my love. I'm like wasting my life. I'm just looking at your resume here and I'm trying to figure out you and this everything. I, and I just can't grasp whether or not you play fat. It's not a bad thing, trust me, Katie. It's just you're too big to play the pretty girl in the lead, you know, but you're too pretty to play the fat girl. I think about myself and like, I'm a full-grown adult who's fully capable of making like real change in the world. And I get bent out of shape because I can't book a macaroni grill commercial. I feel like the universe is like telling me that I'm supposed to do something with my life that's different. Like, like follow my purpose, find the flow, rescue dogs. Well, aren't you doing that now? Yeah, but I think I'm supposed to do it full time. Anderson Pooper! Anderson Cooper! Oh, thank you so much for grabbing him. He's yeah. always slipping away from me. I think I'm just waiting for my whisper moment. I live in Los Angeles, and if you're ever out there, I work with dogs like Anderson. If you make it out there and you're healthy, then you can, you can join us, okay? Maybe. I like food too much to be an actress anyway. <laughs> I can hear everything you're saying. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Some people have jobs. They go to work in the morning. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. The nerve. Wow. I can see what this is. This is this is your baby. It is yeah. my baby. It is. Yeah, a hundred percent. Do you just you mentioned that you won a major award for this? I did. We actually just came back from the Nashville Film Festival um, in Nashville, and, and we took home best, best series, series of the Nashville yeah. Film Festival. So yeah. Wow. Yeah, we had an incredible time in Nashville. It was so fun we had too. a very nice such time. a good time here. And now you're here at Catalyst. <laughs> and then yeah. it's just mm -hmm. like a dream. I feel like I'm in a dream. Yeah. It's very cool. Uh, what have you? Who have you talked to so far mm -hmm. that you have maybe made connections with that you can take this to this next? Sure. Um, platform. So many people. I mean, I think it's so important to connect with creators because here, these are the up and coming people that are going to be moving on and making shows and just connecting with those people. Mm -hmm. and, and, you know, I've met some great folks at CBS um, and kind of laid that foundation. So now down the line, you know, the next project or, or whatever it is, you can go and go to them and say like, hey, I have this. Like, what do you what do you think? And um, some great producers from some awesome production companies. It's just been really cool that you're able to mingle here in a way that I think that you aren't at other festivals. Um, you mentioned CBS. Mm -hmm. So uh, that would be 
one avenue, obviously, mm, right? So are you, you are open to possibilities with when it comes to a web-based series, sure, whatever. Yeah, 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 absolutely. Um, I've noticed, and I was talking to two other young women here mm -hmm. in, on the set, mm -hmm. and this conference is interesting for me because I'm seeing so many more women mm -hmm. kind of, yeah, creating <laughs> oh their own, like their yeah. own space yeah. to create their own stuff. Yeah. Yeah. What is that about, do you think? I think it's a tremendous time for female creators really and artists. And I think it's hopefully a, a new dawn, right? A new day where, where all shapes and sizes are celebrated, where all, you know, women's creative ideas are being celebrated. And we're really in a time, I think, where, yeah, that we are just relating to one another and, and we're, I don't want to say over the, the perfect figure of a, of a woman, you know, but that was, I, yeah. that felt, when I grew up, I feel like that was what was on television. There was a, an ideal. And I just love this time right now where we're celebrating all shapes and sizes. Just, yeah, just real creative content. Yeah, um, yeah. which has been so much about what this project was. For me, the inspiration came from a true manager saying to me, like, you're, you know, the thing is, is that you're like, you're just too fat to play the lead roles, but like you're too pretty to play the fat roles. Mm. And that's where this inspiration of this ball came from. And I just, uh, it's a very exciting time because as a child, I grew up not seeing anybody like mm -hmm. myself in a lead role. And so now you have shows like Shrill on Hulu and these shows that are representing different bodies. And I want to be able to tell a story that, tell, that shows a body that's not just about the body. It's about mm -hmm. the person. Right, and the soul that's in that person yes, too, right? What are your next steps? <laughs> um, you know, hopefully moving forward. Yeah, um, I mean, we're getting buzzed, so that's fantastic. And, yeah. and a lot of people are really responding to the. To yeah, it, so and you know, really trying, you know, <clears throat> moving forward, trying to pitch this. And I'm also, I'm writing another pilot that's more involved in, um, you know, the idea of, of a social media star that's uh, also very depressed on the inside, but on the outside mm. is, is very open. Um, so, you know, just moving forward and creating. That's the next step. So bef before you go, mm -hmm. uh, just a quick question about the use of social media yeah. mm -hmm. to then get that buzz going. Mm -hmm. How is it working for you in this project? It's I, been working yeah, really yeah. well, actually. I think using hashtags and um, making sure that you're using those hashtags that are associated with the project and yeah. the, like the catalyst hashtag and um, moving forward, just kind of getting, building a new audience every day, I kind of see our following going up yeah I mean it's not it's not like we have thousands of followers yeah. but like it'll go up a few but we will. like oh yeah. so now we have a new it's a true yeah audience of like a true person that wants to follow and see like what what happens and what's next yeah, yeah. Julia and Bettina it's been a pleasure oh, so and I wish you all the best thank, thank you, you. Thank and you so I can much. say when you you when you really get this on the um, network or whatever platform that is that when it make when it makes it really really big yeah. I can say I got to meet you guys oh. Thank sure. you so much. Thank Best you. of luck. Yeah, thank you. Bettina Bilger and Julia Tokars, and it's Top Dog is the project. So we have much more to come here at the WDSE WRPT Media Lounge at the Catalyst Content Festival. Stick around.